We're going to do a drill today. We don't have a lot of fancy drills. We just try to get things done so that they have a proper swing, proper balance, using their eyes right, and having good timing. And this drill will incorporate all, all of those things. So we're going to use uh, Patrick here to, as a demonstrator to uh, work on the things we're going to, you're going to be able to see in the video uh, after we get done right here. All right, so we're going to start this drill talking about some fundamental things. It's one thing to do a drill, it's another thing to do it correctly. And in that, there's a few things that we want to emphasize to our hitters. Number one, when he's at the plate, he's got a stance that he likes that's comfortable and balanced. Patrick uses a balance in his stride. So sometimes we have guys that like head between their feet. Other guys like to ride the inside of their back knee with their head. Either way is okay, but we want to have good balance. So first element is what we do is we want that good balance, but we're going to stride to see the ball. We're not striding to swing. We're striding to see the ball, then have the swing happen. We'll describe what we mean by the swing in just a minute. All right, so with Patrick here, he's going to, we're not doing the front side right now, but he's going to try, along with having his weight on the inside of his back knee, to keep his weight in his back hip as he's striding. So we'll show you that he's there. That puts him in a good power position. The next move he makes, instead of a spin rotation, we're going to talk about staying close, as most hit, hitting coaches say. I like to use young guy, with young guys, or anybody for that matter, just stay sideways. Stay sideways and we're going to have a weight shift instead of thinking spin. So often when they do that spin, they lose the outside half, they do too much of an arm swing and they don't have their weight with them when they hit the ball. Because when we hit the ball, we want to hit with our weight getting there and not just our arms. So he has a stride, he's striding to see the ball, then the weight shift, the body comes up, the whole backside comes in, his hands are here, and then contact, extension, and follow through. The main thing is, at contact, we want the weight to be there and not the arms to be way out ahead where we actually lose power or hook balls. <clears throat> the other part we're going to work on as well is what we're going to do with our eyes. Several guys have emphasized this recently, and you can see on great hitters, Barry Bonds has a really good, simple drill to do. But this one, if guys start getting in this situation where they get to here, they may have everything going right, and then right here they start to raise their eyes. That happens far more often than it should. So to prevent that and to have them square the ball up better, we're going to tell them you're striding to see the ball, timing the ball with that weight shift or backside, and then as you hit the ball, you're going to leave your eyes down and not see where the ball goes. Now that, that's tough for a lot of young hitters because they like to pick their eyes up. But that's also why a lot of young hitters miss balls and don't drive them well. So in a moment here, we'll get, uh, get the drill going and let you see what Patrick's doing. All right, here we go. We're going to go three outside to begin with. That's pretty good eyes down right there. Good. Good weight shift. All right, now. We're going to try one more of those, try to get him to think more line drive rather than get the ball so much in the air. Here we go. One more. Keep that weight in that back hip. All right. Okay. Now we're going to go th three up the middle. Remember what he's working on. Striding to see the ball. Then weight shift. Then eyes down to contact. Good, good eyes down. Now boy, good backside, keep that weight there. Atta baby, good. All right, then we'll go three inside. Good, good backside. You gotta be a little quicker with the legs and the backside so the weight gets there. 
Oh, nice. Good sound. Whoop. What happened to your eyes right there? Came up. All right, let's go see. Good. All right. Well done.